Hey girl, what's up with you? Wait a minute, is this the right number? It's, um, the loser line. Come on, just call me back. If you haven't heard the loser line before, it works like this. Let's say someone approaches you while you're out at the club and uses this charming pickup line on you. Excuse me, young lady, oh. but is your name Bane? Oh. I only ask because you're making my dark night rise. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, why did I like that? That was so bad. Now, whatever you do, don't take his grappling hook and tie him up to a urinal. Yeah. Instead, tell him there's a distinct possibility that he could be your caped crusader for the oh. night. Minus the cape. And that's when you give him the digits to the loser line. So hopefully he leaves an awkward voicemail that we can play on the air. Voicemails like this one. Next message. Hey, this is Ch uh, I saw you the other day at the grocery store. I know it was kind of late and, um, you know, but uh, I just really, really liked you. And uh, I thought maybe we could hang out sometime. I, I don't know if you, if you're up late or if you uh, want to come over to, um, come over to, hang out with me sometime I, I would really like that um anyway I'm, I'm pretty much free um most of the time and uh just maybe maybe you could just give me a call at um and um i'm just really looking forward to your call all right Next message. Mm. Why was that so awkward? Yeah, because it's slow. Yeah. Because whenever men try to use their sexy voice, yeah. it just ends up is that creepy. What that was supposed it to be feel, sexy? I think yeah. so. Yeah. 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 It feels like <laughs> he's got like duct tape in his trunk. And what does pretty much free most of the yeah. time mean? Yeah. yeah. It means that he really has nothing going on. So, uh, okay. so, and a little hard to get. Yeah. yeah. There you go. <laughs> no friends, <laughs> except for the imaginary ones. Yeah. And probably no pets, uh -huh. except probably for the imaginary not. ones. Yeah. Next message. Hey, baby, this is Daniel from the other night. It's great meeting you. Look, I, I just dying to go on a rafting trip. I, I can't swim, okay? So I need you to protect me. Um, oh. you know, it was a trip I always wanted to take, but uh, I know you mentioned you're a lifeguard. So, like, should I fall in the river? You know, I need you to give me CPR, you know, mouth to mouth. You know, you can use your tongue, whatever you need to use. All right, so uh, give me a call back. Bye. Next message. Oh, yeah. That is the that is the rule, right? When you're doing CPR, it's you thrust your tongue along to, ha, ha. Huh, yeah. Huh. Staying alive. Staying alive. <laughs> and remember, you get the special loser line number if you text the word loser, L O S E R, to 78592. Give it to somebody who's weirding you out, and so they can call it and leave an awkward voicemail that we can play for you. Voicemail is kind of like this one. Next message. Hey, Andrea. This is Paul. Uh, we met at McDonald's last week in the play area. I, you know, I'm the guy I told you that I didn't have kids, but I really wanted to meet you at the end of the day uh, because you're one of the hottest single moms I have literally ever met at McDonald's. Like, uh, <laughs> I'd probably call you Mick Hot. <laughs> oh, but, uh, and honestly, I should know I'm, I'm really, I, I usually like moms. I usually go for moms. I honestly, Andrea, you're so freaking hot. I would love to be the daddy to your son. Next message. Oh, God. Okay, wow. this is going to sound creepy, but um, I've seen girls that hot before. When I'm online and I'm like, oh, three kids, yeah. I will be the father to all say, of them right away. We're talking about the McDonald's playground. Yeah. I know. Yeah. It doesn't he's, matter. He's in the ball pit doing yeah, this. I, for it, whatever reason, it's okay that you say that online. <laughs> it's not okay that he's a single dude with the... Ball no, you situation. definitely don't want to be that guy. No. No. The single guy looking for dates at the McDonald's play place. Yeah. Oh, and the last true. time I was there, I was standing there and a kid literally just turned and vomited Ew. on the ground Ew. and then went back to playing. Oh! Like, hey, children, Gross. we're going to leave now. Let's all evacuate. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Next message. Hey, Brett, it's Julie. Um, I hope you remember me. Um, so I just want to let you know I have a power. And it's really strong. So let me just tell you that I have this dream that we have a son together, a little boy, and he's adorable, and he looks just like us, and his name is Chip. And I just, I want you to know that the universe has put it out there and that, you know, I should follow it, right? So I also had a premonition that we got married on the beach and that we have a lake house and that you're going to spoil me with foot rubs because you're so good with your hands. And I just, I just hope you have a good paying um, job um, as, uh, uh, yeah, 
So I just, I just, <laughs> I just, I think you're amazing and we're going to make a really beautiful couple together. So you're just awesome. And I can't wait for Chip to be here with us. Bye. Next Whoa. message. Yeah. Okay, that's I, a little. I have a premonition that she's not going to get a call back. Yeah. Does that make me a psychic? Yeah, you those, are. Yeah. Those They're are the accurate. premonitions of a woman who's never met an actual man before. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's going to all go smooth. Yeah. I like yeah, how yeah. she checked in on his job after she described the lake house. Yeah. yeah. Like, wait oh, wait a minute. How are we funding this? Right. Yeah. <laughs> this is expensive. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't think this through. <laughs> Next message. Hi, this message is for Gretchen. Uh, this is a mark you and I met the other night. Um, and we're talking about going out. I'm wondering actually if I can get a mailing address for you as I'd like to send you some things um, in case things end up where I think they're going to. Um, I have a little bit of a skin issue and I just wanted to send you some things like lotion, body wash, so um, not to irritate myself. And um, I also wanted to, I also wanted to remind you, sorry, to uh, hydrate a lot. A lot. Next message. Wait, huh? why was that creepy? Wow. Like, you need to I, like, I, drink your water is a good thing to say to people. He's but... not a dermatologist, Jose. <laughs> yeah. He's got terrible skin, according to him. Yeah. But why does she need all the lotion? Who doesn't I need a bunch water. of lotion, I don't... Brooke? <laughs> Trust me. I don't know. Getting I'm going to call that guy our loser line MVP okay. for the week. Thank oh, you really? for the hot tip. Oh, yeah. Okay. And for the Costco-sized lotion. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Remember, you can listen to Loser Line regularly at this time every week. Your phone tap's coming up right after this.